Next at 6, dry air and strong winds prompt a new weather watch. And the medical supplies are available, but getting life-saving help to Fanning Island isn't so easy. KGMB 9 News at 6 is next. Fanning Island is a tiny atoll a thousand miles south of Hawaii. One man says it can be a death trap if you get sick there. So he's trying to get medical supplies to the people who live there. KGMB 9's Jim Mendoza joins us with that story, Jim. Thanks, Kahi. When the NCL cruise ships were sailing to Fanning, they would carry those supplies on a regular basis. But the last trip was months ago. From the air, Fanning Island looks like a small footprint floating in the Pacific, just north of the equator. It's a uh, high humidity, probably 90 to 100 degrees there. But the heat is nothing compared to the mortality rate. The 2,100 people who live on Fanning live in the shadow of death. Uh, if a baby can live to be one year old, that'll be the greatest celebration in their life. With diabetes, dengue fever, and severe staph infections as their neighbors, life expectancy on the atoll is just 50 years. There is a small clinic on the island and a small staff, and little in the way of medical supplies. One band-aid can save a child's life or a person's life down there. Since 2003, Rich Smith has gone to Fanning 15 times, taking bandages and taking other medical goods. A lot of children medications, cough medicines, uh, pediatric medicines. But the last trip was in April when NCL made its final sale to Fanning. Now Smith has more supplies and he is asking for help to get them there. Local sailboats that go into that region, those people traveling by sailboat could take supplies down there. Smith has other options, but they are costly. A thousand dollars to send a small container on a private boat, a fee for an airline that can fly a small amount of goods to a nearby island. Smith would then have to somehow get the supplies to Fanning. So the greatest emphasis I can relate is that the people down there are pretty much left to die. Smith says if they get sick, more of the people on Fanning could die unless those supplies come soon. Okay, for more details on how you can help get medical supplies to Fanning Island, see our website and search the keyword Fanning. Jim Mendoza, KGMB 9 News. What a great mission. Yeah, I hope somebody who can help is watching tonight. I huh? do too. There's still lots ahead tonight, including a price.